Well guys, welcome back to another episode. Uh, kind of an early morning here in my family house. I spent the last couple of days editing, filmed an MTB video as you guys probably saw, which is pretty cool. I've actually woken up at like three in the morning every day for the past three days, so uh, that's good. But before we get into today's video, I think you guys are gonna enjoy it because a lot of people have been asking about it, but there's somebody I wanna thank. I just wanna thank Audible for helping and supporting this channel. Uh, it means a lot to me. They are a great company that allows you to actually listen to books instead of reading them which uh, I drive a lot, so that is when I take advantage of the service. Uh, the last book I actually read was Crush It. That was a book by Gary Vee. It's kind of about business, entrepreneurship, stuff I love. So there's a whole bunch of books, fishing books, business books, school books. In case you don't want to read, this will probably come and help you out a lot. If you guys want to get a free 30-day trial, www.audible.com slash APBasson, and the link will be in the description as well. Thank you guys so much. Okay, what are we doing now? Oh, yeah. The puppy. Hey, what's up? Sit, pa. So many questions about the dog. Just like, just endless questions about her. Uh, she's doing great. Uh, she lives with my family right now and she gets to run around whenever she wants. Uh, take her on walks, dog park. She's gained a few pounds, so she's looking a lot healthier than she was. The funny thing about it is, I think she thinks that she's like in a pack. I don't know what kind of dog she is. They never like really confirmed, the vets never did, but uh, she like follows everybody around the house. She never wants to be by herself, other than when she goes outside. Sometimes she likes to explore outside, but other than that, like when she's in the house, follows you all over the place. The only thing she, well she used to rip things up, but she doesn't rip things up anymore. I don't know why in the beginning she did, but now she's kind of like trained herself to be inside a house, I think. So yeah, that's the dog. I know so many people have been asking her about her. And, um, yeah. You ready? I think she loves the Illinois life. To be honest, I kind of miss the Illinois life. And a lot of you guys have been wondering uh, why I've been doing travel videos instead of like fishing as much. And uh, it was just, we just did one travel video to China. And I'm actually going fishing one other cool spot. I've got three other good, big trips planned, but but, you know, in the winter, Illinois kind of sucks. Illinois sucks for about six months of the year. Being able to, like, travel now, and then, like, next week, I think I'm going to stay. Once I get done with, I've got a few things to do this week, and one of the things is actually what I'm doing today, but I'm out of breath from being able to run. But I'm going to come to Illinois for about a month and just bass fish and just relax, do some turkey hunting videos, do a whole bunch of things just in Illinois. So get back to, like, those summer videos that a lot of people liked. Well, summer's just around the corner and we're gonna get back to those. And then one of the reasons why I haven't been posting daily is just cause I kinda got burnt out a little bit and I think I'm like the biggest, I know a lot of people on YouTube say, oh, I'm coming back to daily that like, and then they never do. Like I'm like such a big hypocrite when it comes to that. But I'm just enjoying kind of the, tr when you travel, you can't post. Like when we went to China, there was days where we didn't have Wi-Fi for two or three days. So. That's kind of one of the reasons, but the most reason is I'm just, haven't really got my head in Premiere Pro yet. What are you doing? Here, I'm gonna do this. Here, you want to take this poop? Alex, throw it in the garbage outside. I'll see you later, pup. You sad? No, you don't care. When your mom runs over, the rods with their car. Somehow, this is the only bruise on this one, so I'm bringing this rod with me. I will tell you guys where I'm going as soon as I get to the airport. Cue me getting to the airport right about, boom. Magically transported from my house to O'Hare International Airport. Another day, another flight. Today is kinda, it's gonna be a fun trip, and the reason why I'm, I'm vlogging, uh, the travel is because for the next couple days I'm not going to be filming. This is going to be all for the Guggen Squad channel. Dude, what are the odds? Why didn't John get on this flight? He has a connection too. Why? And this was a hundred bucks. We did not plan this. He flew from Nebraska earlier and we have the same connection to New Orleans. You're not vlogging today? Not vlogging. He just quit? Vlogging, I quit you. <laughs> I'm done with dopey bro. I just talk now. Um, have you ever caught a redfish before? Nope. You excited? Yeah. 
Did, did Rob bring the boxes? I don't think so. <laughs> so the whole idea of us going down to New, New Orleans was we need to do, we're gonna do an MTV, MTB, not MTV, challenge 2v2. Um, actually fishing for redfish with bass baits, which is gonna be cool. And what are we gonna do, spin to see who's partners? Yep. I hope, I, I hope I'm not with him, but how long, you know how long this fight is? Uh, nope. Okay. A couple hours. So we'll see you guys in a couple hours once we land. I'm gonna get to editing, probably listen to some dope beats and take a nap. More than likely just take a nap. I was talking to my camera, people were walking by, they're like, what is this guy doing? Eating popcorn talking to a camera. Well, hello. So what are we doing? I don't know. No one knows. We have no idea. No this, is a, this is a normal Guggen adventure. <laughs> no hotel, no car, no plans. You probably think I travel with too much stuff, but this is literally... I haven't been home in a month. I'm finally gonna be home after this trip. So I've got two suitcases, a drone, a backpack, some rods. The rods that are left after the casualties that they suffered. But now it's Rob Flair and myself. We're, John gets in at like midnight tonight, so he's probably won't be a part of this video, but we are gonna go find kind of a hotel to chill. Shotgun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey guys, I'm still messed up on time. It's night. Good night. We'll catch you guys next time. I know this is gonna sound kind of weird, but it is actually it is actually two days after I filmed this video, and I caught my first redfish. Oh, First redfish here in Louisiana. About a normal size one. Oh, there we go. Eater, what is that, number four? We filmed two Googling videos, which that fish catch is going to be in. And we've had a blast here in New Orleans. Uh, great time. We caught some great fish. And I think we filmed some of the best Googling videos ever. That being said, I'm wrapping this video up. Before I do... Uh, if you guys want to meet us, I know I we love doing meetups and we're hosting a big one. All of us Guggen members are going to be in Rogersville, Arkansas this coming up Sunday. Yes, this coming up Sunday. Had to, ch had to think about that for a second. All the information will be below uh, if you guys want to come and meet us. I appreciate it so much. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. The dog's doing good. And uh, yeah, traveled here to New Orleans and then forgot to finish the video. But this video is going up today. And uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Anything else, Alex? Nope. I think you're good, buddy. We'll see you guys next time on another episode of AP Bassins.